If you guys have been on the internet lately, there has been a rumor going around that the island section of the Resident Evil 4 remake is going to be cut. Now, I would be lying if I told you that I enjoyed the island section of Resident Evil 4. Now, don't mind me. I know it's not that bad, but I just feel like the action segments for it really broke the immersion for me and really ruined the pace. But I know there's a lot of good and memorable sections. For example, Krauser. So recently, the Resident Evil 4 remake director came out and confirmed that they are not going to be removing any content from Resident Evil 4 and they will only improve on it instead. In an interview with Edge Magazine, the director of the Resident Evil 4 remake, Yoshiaki Hirabayashi, I'm sorry if I do butcher his name, denies that the island section will be getting removed. In the magazine, Hirabayashi explained that the team behind the remake is split into three groups, which each group being responsible for building different parts of the game. Those parts are the village, the castle, and the island. To coincide with this, once everything was completed, they would put each section together and figure out how each section worked with each other to create a holistic experience. In addition to dispelling the island rumor, the director said that the section would feature more content than the original, and the section would probably be updated to improve the player experience. Okay guys, wow, so the director came out and said that no content is going to be removed and in addition they are going to be adding more content than we have ever seen to certain sections. I mean they came out and said that the island section is going to be approved upon and that is just a great sign coming from Capcom and you really got to appreciate how much care they're putting into the Resident Evil 4 remake. I'm really going to bet that this is going to be the best game of 2023 the game is set to release in literally two months and i'm just so freaking hyped so currently i think the way that capcom is going to be delivering us news is with these interviewers on these websites i think this is the way that we're going to be getting news for now i mean the game is set to release in literally two months as i mentioned and if this is how they're going to be doing it, I mean, I don't mind personally, but I just hope that we get some more gameplay, some more news, and I'll be making a video of what to expect in the next coming months until we get to that release date. Um, without further ado, guys, that's going to pretty much have to wrap up today's video. I know it's not a long one. Didn't want to make a long video today, and I will catch you guys in the next one. The link is in the description if you guys do want to read it for yourselves. Uh, this was from a couple days ago, so I apologize for that, but thank you guys so much for watching this video with me, guys, and... Peace out.